Hi, welcome back to the channel. This is Z here at Pink Aura Tarot. Thank you guys for subscribing and supporting the channel. Um, this is going to be urgent messages for October 2020. Um, I'm not going to do any more readings um, for October. So the urgent messages are like the last um, readings. And these are very general too. If you're new to the channel, welcome. And you can also check out the other readings that I did for the month, which is the monthly general um readings for each sign and also the monthly love readings um if you want to book a personal reading with me all you have to do is just look in the description box for the link to my um website and all you have to do is just submit your info it's really easy um now i'm starting to do like 48 hour turnarounds for like the readings um that's like if i have too many um like submissive submissions that come in in a day i might tell you that it's going to be a 48 hour turnaround just so i won't feel rushed or like pressured to get the reading out um so yeah that's pretty much it this is going to be an urgent message for cancer sun moon rising and venus so let's see what comes up okay so we got success that came out first card out what urgent messages do you have for cancer yes so we got yes that came out what urgent message do you have for cancers oh we got you are you're ready so cancer it seems like some of you guys are it seems like something's like coming towards you here but it's whatever this is you may not believe that it's coming or believe that you can have whatever this is that you're ready for like you may feel like you're not ready but it says trust and i seen that card um if you believe so for some of your journey is to believe that you are ready for this because whatever it is is going to be very successful trust your intuition because like cancers we're like really intuitive so trust your intuition like if it feels good then like go forward with it because you are ready for it um let's see i'm going to use this the kipper deck to let's see clarify success clarify success yeah whatever um whatever this is is change because we got change right here at the bottom of the day it's like a car um with someone like packing their bags and then we got great fortune that came out for success. So for some of you guys, this could be um, success in regards to your, like, your finances, your career. Um, whatever it is, like you're getting a lot of support as well. Like people are being like very supportive for um, whatever this is. Clarify, yes. Um, yeah, we got despair. And look, this change car is at the bottom of uh, at the bottom of the deck again. So, Cancer, you could be like afraid of this change, but we got despair. They came out with yes. Just know that whatever this is, ooh, for some of you guys, this is something dealing with someone's work because this car right here it says not hiring in the back. So for some of y'all, you could have been in despair here about your your job, your current job situation, or your finances. Whatever that is, it's going to be changing for some people here. Clarify you're ready. Yeah, we got journey that came out. So a lot of travel and movement here something's changing for you guys and it's like you are ready for this journey this is literally what it's saying and some of you guys could be seeing 10 10 i'm a cancer and i've been seeing 10 10 this came out this is card number 10 it's journey and it clarified you already so you're ready for this journey or like this new beginning um this change that's happening and we got official person so um for some of you guys somebody's gonna be like some some sort of support system or some sort of ass assistance to somebody here it's just a official person or this could be you coming out cancer as official person whatever it is that you do for um for like your work or your career this could even be a hobby 
it's like you are official in whatever you do but you just have to trust that you are because for some of you guys you could you could have been going through like some type of financial um setback but i feel like that's going to change like whatever it is whatever it was it had you in despair kind of feeling like left out on the cold as well so let's see clarify success clarify success clarify success okay i'm seeing success in some type of business venture but we got the devil here i feel like this is just like um this could be fear for some people that something's not going to work out But we have the Ace of Wands that came out at the bottom of the deck. This is like something new here. But I don't know why I feel like the devil is like um, people or like a person. Clarify success. Yeah, there's some type of offer here that's coming in for somebody the page of pentacles is some type of offer here could be coming in from a capricorn so the capricorn could have been um the official person or they could have earth in that chart but yeah a lot of movement and something that you've been like expecting here is coming towards you so you could have been waiting for your situation to change clarify yes Yeah, see, look, <laughs> the Wheel of Fortune card came out. So expect a shift or a change. This is like good change here. But I'm trying to figure out why you're in despair. Like some of you guys are closing out a cycle here of financial um, setback or like lacking in your finances. Clarify, yes. Yeah, I feel like you're someone's like fighting. Um, there's like some type of um, conflict here. It could be internal conflict here about some type of support. But I'm also seeing it too, where for some of you guys, it's like you're about to change something here. Something's about to change in somebody's situation that you were like you were like expecting this change, right? But you just didn't know when it was gonna happen. I'm seeing that when this change happens, like something's changing like really, really, really um, tremendously for somebody. Like, I feel like there's going to be some people here that's going to be kind of like against it in a way. Clarify you're ready. Clarify you're ready. Yeah, um, I'm seeing some type of victory here for cancers. We got the ace of swords that came out. For some of you guys, you could be hearing from somebody here. Now, this could be a person. I'm going to clarify the page of pentacles. Because this is like some type of offer here. Clarify you're ready. Yeah, the, um, the, uh, I was about to say the cycle. So, yes, for some of you guys, you're starting a new cycle here with this world card. This is going to be, but I'm seeing this five of wands. I feel like it's like people hating, like, seriously with this five of wands. Because it's right in the middle of the Wheel of Fortune and the, um, the Ace of Swords. It's like something's going to have you, like, in despair, What's the devil? Why is the devil here? So 
so we got the ten of cups that came out for some of you guys somebody's going to be getting recognized here for what they do for work or this could be like some type of hobby or something but also too i feel like um it's like a lot of abundance and prosperity and emotional fulfillment for whatever this is that's coming towards you um i feel like somebody could be dealing with a capricorn too but it seems like something could be coming up here or it's just like it's your time with the um judgment card now some of you guys could actually have an, a person coming back around as well um with this page of pentacles and the wheel of fortune card and we got um judgment at the bottom of the deck what's the page of pentacles Yeah, so the Ace of Wands came out. For some of you guys, you're, um, I'm seeing like a business grow here. Like if you sell something or um, it's like you being patronized here. Like somebody's getting success here in, in, um, in regards to like business. But it's like this is something that had you like in despair here. But I feel like that's changing what's the will of fortune so we got the um king of cups so this is like water sign energy right here i'm seeing like great fortune for somebody because this king of cups could um represent look we got the king of cups and um the queen of cups right here at the bottom of the deck somebody could be dealing with another water sign here but i'm seeing like great fortune what's the um the five of wands why is the five of wands here oh we got the two of cups that came out somebody's about to get in some type of connection here this could be a new partnership a new connection i feel like it's gonna cause a lot of conflict or something what in the world whatever this is i feel like this is not you in despair cancer this is like people around you But it's almost as if somebody feels like left out in the cold or something. What's the ace of um the ace of swords? Yeah, somebody's getting some type of offer here. We got the Knight of Pentacles. The Knight of Pentacles, but then we got the Ace, I mean, the Knight of Swords. So some of you guys could have somebody like rushing in here. If this is like in regards to love, like if this resonates with you in regards to love, I am seeing it that way, especially with the Two of Cups. But with this Five of Wands, there's some type of conflict here going on. Um, like I said, it's like, I feel like it's people. This could be like a group of people, but it's somebody that you have like some type of connection to, like some sort of emotional bond i feel like it could be family members for some people because we got the ten of cups here too it could be in regards to um to family members there is some type of great fortune or success that's happening to somebody here and it's causing some conflict what's the um five of wands yeah somebody's um success here We got the sun card and the star card that came out with the five of wands. Somebody's success is causing conflict here or um, <laughs> wow, hold on. Let's see. What's this five of wands? So we got official person that came out it's card number 22 but somebody is causing some type of like whoever um is coming like if you resonate with being like an official person like whatever you do for work or like your career business it's like you're a, a official person like people know um know you for what you do what's the five of wands 
Tell me more about this five of wands. Yeah, see, concern. With this concern, this is like people hating. Especially with this five of wands. It's like people are concerned or, um, and it's card number 33. But you know what? Three plus two equals five. I'm seeing it this way. It's like five equals change. And with this despair too, it's card number 32. So three plus um, two is five. Somebody's situation is about to change, but it's like it's causing conflict. And we got a message of concern at the bottom with this concern. Yeah, toll and labor. Somebody's about to get recognized here or um, it's like elevation, promotion. Like you just getting some type of offer or this could be some type of deal, a contract that's going to put somebody like in some sort of um, higher position in their work or their career. But it's causing some conflict and concern. Tell me more about this five of wands. Yeah, unexpected income. For some of y'all, you could be getting um, help, like financial help or something from somebody. But I feel like this is like in regards to love or some type of connection that you have that's going to like elevate you. It's going to like put you, um, like take you up a notch in whatever you're doing for work or your career and this is like a new journey and it's saying that you are ready for it but you know what when somebody like elevates or um has some sort of success of course there's going to be people um you know in the background that's concerned or they just hating but whatever this is like it's going to cause some concern with other people So I'm going to leave the reading right here. Hopefully um, it resonated with someone. Feel free to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Thank you.